Patrick. Patrick. Son of a gun. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> when did you get home? Let's go home a few minutes ago. Oh. <laughs> I knew it was coming home. I bought the plane ticket. <laughs> and he got me. There you go. Oh my god. I want to show, show Hannah what I got. We ready to go in? Let's go in. I got to turn off the light. <laughs> Hi, Amy. <laughs> oh, I got Minecraft stuff in the car. <laughs> oh, can I have my sword? Can I? No. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. There it is. Woo! <laughs> He's such a nerd. Stop it. Can you watch them? Thanks. Oh, yeah. Hey, Chad, how are you? Welcome back.
Randall High School senior, this evening's graduation was more than just a ceremony. It was an unexpected family reunion. News Channel 10's Shannon Smith is live at the studio with more on how this plan was put into action. Reese Cryer hadn't seen his older brother Travis Fannin since September when he was deployed to Kuwait with the U.S. Marine Corps. So you can imagine how surprised he was to see Fannin standing on the stage at Randall High's graduation holding his diploma. Our next graduate is being presented his diploma by his brother, Lance Corporal Travis Fannin of the Marine Corps of 2000. Fannin found out Wednesday morning that he'd been granted leave to come see his little brother graduate from Randall High School. The boy's mom reached out to Randall High's principal to see if the school could make the day special for the brothers. Of course, I mean, why not? I mean, let's, let's do this and let's do it right. So graduation's already pretty special. But to have your brother come in from Kuwait and give you your diploma, you know, that's just going to blow it off the top. I mean, it's going to be pretty cool. Williams snuck Fannin on stage during the ceremony, and the whole time, Cryer had no idea what was planned for him. I like, I like surprising people. It brings just a smile to their face, and everyone's happy. I hope he doesn't cry. But he's, he's a strong boy. Yeah, he'll do good. Fannin did not get his wish. His little brother cried, and the reunion was emotional and exciting for the whole family. Cryer ran to hug his brother as the audience cheered. He says he was shocked, surprised, and so happy to see Fannin after all this time. Glad to be home with my brother. That's all I can say. Congratulations, little brother. Thank you. Congratulations to Reese and the entire class of 2016, and thank you, Lance Corporal, for your service. Reporting live in the studio, Shannon Smith, News. Come in. Oh my gosh, Nick! <laughs>
Good evening, everybody. Would you please join me in the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to thank Airman First Class Derek Maggart for leading us in the pledge this evening. Derek is the brother of graduating senior Miranda Maggart. What makes this so special is that Derek was able to arrive from Osan Air Base in South Korea in time for his sister's graduation ceremony. Miranda, for the last four weeks, I've known your brother is going to come. It's been the hardest thing for me not to tell you. I was going to tell you to feel free to come on up to give him a hug, but you beat me to it. Thank you, sir. It's a big setup happening all around eight-year-old Elijah Murray Howard. He has no clue. He thinks that another student in another class is being honored. <laughs> he thinks his mom, private first class Joanne Murray, is in Kuwait, where she's been deployed for nearly a year. But she's here, ready to pull off a real surprise during a fake assembly. He's going to think for about five seconds that you send a video message. Okay. And then you're going to appear. Okay. At this point, Elijah stands with his teacher and thinks a special video message is about to play as soon as some technical difficulties are ironed out. And then this. Do you think it was from me? <laughs> I don't know. When I saw him, it's just, I missed him so much. He knows that his mom is, is doing a service to the country, and um, he knows why she's over there. And so he's, he's happy about that. He's more proud, if anything. Pride and a big surprise. Worth another look.
Oh. It's recording, all right? Wait a minute. Let me get a video. Let me get a video. Let me get a video. Man, so I'm going to cover it. Don't drop it, y'all. Don't drop it. You might need to do that outside because it's too heavy. Okay. Well, open your eyes.